Happy holidays, beauties. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well and healthy this holiday season. I can't believe Christmas is like right on the corner, you guys. I hope you guys are staying healthy and getting all of your holiday shopping done or shopping gatherings ready for this weekend. Well, if you don't follow me on Facebook, you really should. My Facebook is um, facebook.com forward slash beauty chameleon. I'll post it here in a link in the information box below. But uh, last night or a few nights ago, if you're seeing this video a little later, I had posted a picture because many of you guys have saw my Sephora haul and my tutorials before this video of me wearing um, nail polishes with glitters on top of me. You guys are like, when are you going to make a tutorial? You know, you should make a tutorial showing us how you did that. And it's something super easy. So what I did is I posted um, four nail colors on Facebook and, um, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm getting over cold, you guys, so don't mind my voice. But I posted four colors on Facebook from a holiday red, I think, till we meet a grin, a silver, and a black. And I had you guys vote on which polish I would do for my nail video for the Christmas New Year season. And I thank you all so much for all your responses, but it came down neck and neck from uh, between Till We Meet Again and Queen of Everything. And out of all the votes, Queen of Everything won. So if you um, haven't seen a thumbnail for the video, um, this is the nail look I'm gonna be doing in this video featuring Queen of Everything, which is this color. And you can find both of these at Sephora. But this is the silver I'll be using on the nail. And then I'll be using this versatile um, nail color from Sephora by OPI. And this is called, um, I believe it's called Sparktacular Top Coat. So if you like to know how I created this very fun glittery um, nail polish look you can wear for Christmas or you can rock it out for New Year's Eve, you stay tuned and just keep on watching. Okay, divas, let's get started. The very first thing you want to do is just make sure your nail surface is very clean. Um, if you guys don't know, I typically get my nails... Um, covered with acrylic overlay so these are my nails they just put an overlay on top to protect them because I am very um, hard on my nails so that's what um, you see on my nails here um, if you live in the Austin area I go to VIP nails in Cedar Park and I really love Cindy there so if you're needing some overlays or nails go see her but anyway on to the tutorial um, thank you so much to my Facebook divas out there that helped me out um, the other night but I listed about four different colors to use for this tutorial and you guys chose um, queen of everything so the first polish we will be applying all over the entire nail is queen of everything and this is by Sephora by OPI queen of everything goes on very opaque so I believe just about two layers of this will be more than plenty to get a nice beautiful silver finish for this this nail tutorial so go ahead and polish your nails all the way through and then once you polish your nails you definitely want to give your nails a few minutes to dry before applying on the fun um, silvery um, nail polish to the tips Now once you have the nail polish on, like I said before, definitely give your nails a little bit time to dry. I say give it about two to five minutes to dry and then we can move on to the very next color. Okay, welcome back. Now that we have Queen of Everything all nice and dry, the next polish we're going to be using is from Sephora by OPI and I love this color. This one's called Sparktacular Top Coat and it's just a clear polish with a whole bunch of different flecks of glitters. You can see greens. A little bit of gold, silver, teal, red. This is a perfect top coat that you can use on top of any nail polish color. Um, I've used this with Till We Meet Again, which is a green nail polish. I use it with my red that I posted on Facebook and also my black Never Enough Shoes from Sephora by OPI as well. So I like this one because it's very versatile, but we're going to get ready to apply this on. Like I showed in my... Um, one nail, or makeup tutorial, it's really easy. I believe it was my makeup haul I did from Sephora. This is really easy to create this effect. Simply take your nail polish, and all you wanna do is start tapping it on the tips, just like this here. Just start tapping it on to get started. 
you can see the glitters are starting to disperse on and once you do that you can start beginning to drag it downward as far and deep as you want it by doing this you get a really pretty almost kind of salon like nail application with this um, beautiful nail polish And you can have this applied on as thick or as um, thin as you would like it to be. So I'm just dragging this down and applying a top coat just like that. So using that same technique, you can go ahead and do that to all the rest of the nails. Once you created all of your glittery tips, again, I would give this a few moments to dry, probably about a good three to five minutes. And then um, once you get it somewhat dry, go ahead and place a top coat. My favorite one is the one by Sedge Beach. You can find this at um, Sally Beauty Supply and Ulta, but this will give it a nice finish, nice glossy finish, and also um, help elongate your nail polish wear. Um, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll see you toward the end of the video for a little bit more remarks. Welcome back. I hope you guys enjoyed this super doozy, easy way of creating some very beautiful glittery glammy nails you can wear for Christmas or you can rock it out for New Year's Eve. Both of these nail polishes you can find at your local Sephora or Sephora.com and I believe they both sell for about $9.50 each. But I really love how easy you can kind of create this very fun glammy nail look without having to be an artist to create this nail look. Um, I hope again, I hope you guys enjoy it and stay tuned. I'm going to do a warmer look to close out the year and it's going to be a super fun, glittery um, New Year's Eve look. So stay tuned for that. And then after that video, I'm going to be doing my beauty favorites of 2011. And you probably won't see that till New Year's Day. But um, stay tuned, you guys. There's going to be so many new things coming up in the new year, um, uh, new projects I'm working on that I'm so excited to share with you guys. So stay tuned. Um, I hope you guys, again, are doing well and getting ready for this wonderful Christmas. And if I don't see you before Christmas, you all have a Merry Christmas and a wonderful new year. Talk to y'all later. Bye.